I'm Fatima and I drive a 2014 Subaru XV. I am an HR professional by day. I enjoy going to the gym, so I work out three times a week. I do the odd maidens. Um, I used to bodyboard, I'd like to get back into it. I've got my garage behind me. I know guys have got man caves, I've got my own cave with my mountain bikes, my um, hiking gear, my um, bodyboarding gear. So yeah, so I thoroughly enjoy the outdoors uh, with friends all by myself. I needed something that was both uh, urban friendly as well as something that could take me off road on a weekend away. So the XV came in quite good. Um, from that perspective, I found a Forester too big for me and the, all the other models weren't gonna work for the needs and the requirements that I had. Uh, value for money, uh, the safety rating was very important and also the wheels. I thoroughly loved the wheels when I saw it for the first time, so yeah. My most memorable um, adventure that, I, that I've been on was two girls, a Subaru XV, going up the Sunny Pass by ourselves. And everyone thought we were ridiculous to try and attempt it because I don't think there was one before, uh, a sub Subi that went up before us. Because uh, it's normally like your bigger vehicles, 4x4 off-roader off type vehicles. And as we made our way to the top, I will never forget, we were driving up slowly and um, making our way through all the turns and people actually came and they thought, the bigger vehicles came and they thought like, oh gosh, do you guys need help? And we're like, no, we don't need help. We're just taking a slow drive up to the top. And as we made it to the top, everyone was literally staring at us, wondering if these two girls will actually make it. But we actually did it. It was fun. It was very cold. It was icy. The conditions were icy. There were a few parts where we thought that we might just slip. Um, we were even advised to take uh, chains with, to put around the tires and stuff. But uh, we actually didn't need it because the car performed way better um, than what we've expected. And since then, there's been quite a few XVs that made it to the top. So yeah, so that was my biggest and greatest adventure in my car. I remember driving on the N2 from Strand coming back to the side of to, to Bloberg after visiting my parents and it was a rainy night and I actually aquaplaned on the N2 but immediately the all-wheel drive system kicked in and made sure that I actually stick to the ground which was quite good and, uh, and then I like literally patted the car and I was like okay this is what you were made to do like to keep me safe. So yeah, so I thoroughly like that cemented my uh, feeling toward the brand and the tagline confidence in motion. I'm, I'm so attached to this car firstly, so I will never get rid of it because of all the memories that we've got uh, have together and the trips I've done on it uh, with it. But um, if I do get another one, it will definitely be a forester because now you're obviously thinking it's age appropriate, it's appropriate for, um, for children one day. So yeah, not that like we need another one because we already have two, but I think a forester for myself, yeah. So in three words, I would describe the brand Subaru as exhilarating, fun and adventurous. Perfect. And that's my Subaru story. <laughs>